Hi guys, it's your girl Ina here. So I made a new video, but I just realized if you haven't watched my other video about um, the ads, uh, once my channel got monetized, it's not really gonna make sense. So I'm gonna just put a little clip of that last video first so that the whole thing makes sense and I don't have to tell the whole story again. So enjoy this clip from the video where I, ex where I show you who the first advertisers were on my YouTube page. You have to see who, what ads are put on my videos. And I literally, I've really been thinking about this and wondering like what are gonna be the first ads that I can see on my own videos. So in case anyone's wondering, badge cream. <laughs> So the first, after months of literally wondering what ads are going to be put, yeah, because I'm an old middle-aged lady, not just once, all of my ads, all of my videos have ads from Badge Cream. So just when you start thinking you're something cool and something special, and you're going to get Mercedes ads on your on your videos and espresso and good wine, you know what you get? Vag cream. So don't ever think that you're hot stuff because then the reality is vag cream. Okay, so you see who were the first advertisers. Now, as with all my stories, it progresses. Now watch the second part to see what happened after I had this, this company advertised on my YouTube page. Were. And what was my first ad? It was vag cream. Okay, now I made a video about this and, and the video, went, I think it had like 500 views in a couple of days. It really, it really took off. I'll put the video right here if anyone wants to have a look at it. And it was kind of, you know, for my little tiny channel, a little, a little video I made about, oh look, Vag Cream is my first endorsement or my first uh, advertiser. Everyone got a big kick out of it and everyone had a big laugh about it. So um, basically it was a completely spontaneous video. We shot it in my living room with no lighting. No, the camera, my wife held the camera the wrong way. It was complete, but just like my original video that went viral, it wasn't planned, everything, nothing special. And that kind of video kind of picked up. So what I found interesting was a lot of people started, you know, Red Cream is kind of a, a sensitive time. It's not something you talk about every single day or that you would even talk about in a public forum. But because this ad was placed on my video and I made a joke about it, people were joking around on, on my YouTube channel, people were joking around in my Facebook and writing messages to me like, oh, you should do a, a, a product endorsement video and all this stuff. So ha 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 ha. Okay, so that's finished in the past, whatever. And I think that was on the 3rd or 4th of December. Well, as you guys know, on the 9th of December, I had to go in for my knee surgery. So the, on the 8th, I was here trying to clean up my office and kind of turn it into my little rehab room with a little guest bed and get my dressing room kind of cleaned up a little bit so everything was really easy to get to. But just basically getting ready for my surgery because I had to go in the next morning. And then I went in the living room to have a cup of coffee and um, ding dong, my doorbell rings. So I'm dunk dunk on my crutches. It took me a while to get from the living room to the front door. And by the time I get to the front door, I open up the front door, I see the DHL guy sitting in this truck in front of my house going like this, like pointing at my mailbox. So I go to my mailbox, there's this package. I'm like, what, what, what could this be? It's the return address is Dr. Court Wolf, which is a medical supply, medical um, product company um, that we have here. I'm like, what the heck is this? So I'm thinking it has to do with my knee surgery because I'm getting this knee surgery the next day. And I'm like, why are they sending like medical stuff to my house? Like, do I have to bring my own stuff? Like, <laughs> Do I need to bring a fake knee? Like, do I have to do my own surgery? Okay, I've had one before, but I'm not gonna to do my own surgery. Like, why are they sending supplies to my house? No, it had nothing to do with my knee. This is what got sent to my house. So, from the company that produces the, the ads that were my first ads on my thing, sent me free samples of the product, I guess because I mentioned it on my YouTube channel, which as you know, you guys, people skip through ads, people don't really look at the ads, and if somebody actually sits and talks about it and brings a little bit of attention, I probably got them more attention from this thing, and to be honest, these two products probably cost 10 times more than the money I've made on YouTube this month because it's really, 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 really not that much. So I said, you know what, if these people are gonna, I'm gonna put this here so I make sure everyone can see it. If these people are gonna send me a product that, that in Switzerland everything costs a lot of money, if they're gonna send this to me, I'm gonna talk about it. So that's what I'm gonna do today is talk about Patricent, since now I have a, a product endorsement thing going on here. Um, so I have to be completely honest. 
not a product I've ever used before. Um, so I had to do some research, but, uh, but like I said, if they're going to send me a product, I'm going to talk about it and hopefully open up a dialogue. If anybody wants to talk with each other women around the world in our age group, maybe this is a good place to do it because it's a safe space on my little page because we're in our own little bubble, <laughs> our own little Ina, Ina town bubble. Anyway, so the product basically, this is called, um, uh, it's kind of like moisturizing cream for Mrs. Happy. <laughs> so... Um, reasons that Mrs. Happy might need some uh, additional moisture. Uh, again, I did some research. Hormonal imbalances, so uh, pre-menopause, menopause, things like this. Um, different things like different kinds of cancer treatment. If you've had prolonged use on the birth control pill, um, drinking and smoking, uh, stress, tampon use, all kinds of things can cause some dryness down in your Liberace. So if you need some something to wet Lady Gaga's whistle, you might want to look into this cream. So this cream, um, what, again, I did some research to make sure I wasn't talking some baloney. Um, what makes this product fantastic is that it's hormone free, it's uh, fragrance free, so perfume free, and it's medicine free, there's no medication in it. It's really just a moisturizing cream. Um, so, if you are breastfeeding or if you are on some kind of hormone treatments, whether it being like after a, a, a part of breast cancer treatment or things like this, um, and you're on hormone treatment, you, you might really want and need something that does not have any additional hormones in it, which is why something like this would be fantastic. So it's medicine free, fragrance free, hormone free, and basically used to make sure your Christmas cookie is not getting dried out. Okay. So um, yeah, so let's have a look at what we've got in here. Now, I'm on this journey also with you guys because I personally, while Aunt Rosie doesn't come to town every month like she used to, she comes sometimes, but she doesn't visit it every 28 days like she used to. So, you know, I'm in, I'm in that stage of life, but I don't have the particular, so um, sorry, I had to stop that because I literally couldn't think of a word and uh, I, as you notice, I can talk for a long time and I couldn't think of a word. The word I was looking for symptoms. Anyway, although menopause is knocking on my door, and like I said, Aunt Rosie doesn't come visit as much as she used to, um, I don't personally suffer from the uh, symptoms for which this medicine is necessary. However, we're going to talk about it anyway for you guys that might, um, and then also to that you know what is available from this particular product in case you will need it. Okay, so we've got this tube. And this is the moisturizing cream. Um, hold it the right way. Okay. And what you need to do is with this little pointy thing, poke in the end, and then it comes with this applicator. Let's see if I can figure this out live. Um, so it comes with this applicator. And what you need to do is, let's see if I can figure that out. Okay, so this looks like it goes here. Oops. This goes here. Twist that on there, okay? Fill it up with your product like this, squeeze it in there, fill the whole thing up. Then you want to go, whoop. Wow, oh, okay, I believe that. So, like the Space Shuttle Challenger, rest in peace, Kristen McAuliffe, up the chute, boom, push the button, push the product out, up um, the Eiffel Tower. You know what I mean? Okay. And then, actually, that's kind of nice. It's, um, it just seems like regular cream. Well, I'm assuming that it's made specifically for the area that it's going to be um, applied, but yeah, it's, it's no, no smell. It's very, very light. I expect it to be more watery. I don't know why, but it's very light and Face cream. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to waste it. I just got out of the shower, so I use a little face cream. So yeah, it's good. Um, if I have a fantastic complexion, then we're gonna we're ha gonna have a breakthrough right here. And I hope I get some kind of a credit for it. I hope this doesn't make my well. I'm not gonna see what. It, do you know what? I just had the funniest joke pop in my head. <laughs> and see, I can keep. I can refrain. Okay, I'm not going to say that joke. Okay, but something I did read um, on the website from Badgestan was another advantage to this product 
is that it gets um, Gladys Knight and the pips lubricated, if you know what I mean. So if your husband wants to go to Paradise City or your wife wants to go downtown, or if you want to go Christmas shopping by yourself, <laughs> this product is also is also going to help you in that area. I like this as a face cream. Okay, Woo! it's dripping out of my table. Okay, so that's that product. Okay, this product is the ointment form. Okay, so supposedly from what I read that this is the ointment form, if you have more severe symptoms, like if you haven't been taking care of Mrs. Happy, if Mrs. Happy is Mrs. Sad and Mrs. Sad is maybe itchy, some damage to the skin, then you want to use this one from what I read on their website. Now, this one is an ointment form, so this one is water-based and this one is more fat-based and just has that little safety seal thing on it. And okay, yeah, this is more of a, this is thicker. This is more of an ointment. So this is more like, um, Oh. Also, doesn't really have a flavor, uh, flavor, uh, smell. Yeah, it's nice. I mean, I, I know if I ever need it, I know what product I'm going to use. This is good stuff. It's nice. It's not, again, ointments, you think of ointments are really, you know, I didn't think that I was going to be as impressed by this stuff. Ointments, you th they're always, th I don't like ointment because it's so like, mwah, mwah, mwah. And gross, this is very light and it, and it like rubs in nice. Oh, I'm gonna use this stuff on, I'm gonna use this stuff on my face. And I'm not even kidding, because I am literally that cheap that I would, it's protective ointment. I'm gonna use it on, I'm gonna use it on my face. Let's see what happens. So if you notice my complexion looking nice, I've got badge cream on my face. See, there's another joke that I didn't make that is right there at the tip of my tongue that I didn't say. See, I'm, I've got, I've got control over myself. Who says, who says I have no control over my emotions? I kind of, well, I kind of do. Okay, so that's my, that's my Vagisan spiel. Um, thank you to Vagisan for sending me the product to try out. And for those of you ladies, for, for you, um, for my viewers, for my audience, for my friends and family, for all of you, um, let's not make this a taboo issue. If anyone wants to talk about it, let's talk about it on my page. I think it's interesting. Um, also, Vagisan, if you want to read about it, uh, you can go to vagisan.com. That's the English version if you want to read about it in English. If you want to read about it in German, vagisan.de. And it's got a, that's the German website. And um, I also thought, since most of you are in the area of the United States, if you want to order this, it is available on Amazon. So you can order it in the States from Amazon if you want to give it a try if, if you need it. Anyway, so thanks, Vagisan. My first product endorsement. I hope you guys enjoyed that little... Uh, hopefully a little bit educational uh, walk down walk down vagina lane and um, yeah thanks Vagisan check out their product if you need it please make a comment I think we can open up a nice interesting conversation about this and we'll see you soon next time thanks for visiting have a nice day bye guys bye